Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Shadowrun Returns, episode number six, on uh, our second playthrough on very, very hard difficulty, very difficult difficulty. What's it called again? I can't remember. Officer Aguirre. Hey, what are you doing here? Well, Dresden called me. Even though I didn't. Okay, so when you pay the three hundred dollar bribe at the Blind Lucy uh, crime scene, uh, when it comes time to find out about this. Murder, Officer Aguirre calls you, not uh, not Dresden, but apparently, yeah. Uh, the victim worked here at the NTSB warehouse. NTSB? Because I don't know what the NTSB is, apparently. Uh, let's see, scientists don't make good criminals. Whatever. I'm going to go in here. I still have access to the computer. Because, like, when you pay the 300 they're like, oh, we, you know, left that door unlocked for you. So stupid. Oh, well. The computer's not logged on. Interesting. So apparently that's what you miss out on. Don't you get information that you sell to the fixer? I think that 300 new yen actually comes back to pay for itself. Oh, well, whatever. Uh, inspect the toothbrush. The blue toothbrush is still wet from being used. It smells of mint and cigarettes. I'll inspect the comb. It's a black plastic comb. Great. Oh, I guess that's all stuff for the second part of this little thing. I gotta go. Gotta go talk to Shannon first. Yeah, hey, thanks for all the useful information there, a-hole. Sorry I didn't pay your freaking bribe. Oh, yeah, okay, so if you're a rigger, you can actually get into this room. I think it's... Like, I don't think you can deck... So, as much as I complain about decking being, like, the end-all be-all, in this case, rigging will get you in there. Uh, I watched a video where a guy, like, sent a... Well, I'll show it to you when we get there. Um, you're not a cop. That's right. I'm independent. Ah, uh, that murdered... Murdery is my, uh, is my brother. Oh, that's crazy. You look like a shaman. That's racist, but you look like a shaman. Uh, yeah. Were there any other witnesses? No, just the spirits. Oh, the spirits... Well, we might as well try a seance then and talk to spirits, because that's what us shaman do. See what I'm saying? Like, we're one of the anyway, uh, I'll do what I can. i got to go look for items. Let's go back. Oh, wait. Let's talk to Dresden. Dresden, thanks for the call. Hey, man, you're making a lot of money. Business is good for the Dialamorg. Oh, this might not have been a ripper because it was too messy, and they took a bunch of things, or it's hard to tell what they took. I can't remember what it was. Anyway... Sounds like the Ripper's taking shortcuts. Who's the woman over there? I just talked to her, so I already know the answer to that. I don't know why I just asked you. Uh, run faster, little man. Yes, the lockers. Give me that toothbrush. Or the comb. You know, my friend said that you can actually get three items here. I am, I've only ever gotten two. The comb and like a necklace or something? I can't remember what it was. God, run faster! Um, but yeah, he said if you get three, you get like an extra scene, I guess? If that makes sense. Or uh, When you summon the spirit, they tell you like an extra little detail. And supposedly it's right out of these shoes, so I don't know why... Oh my god, this game's driving me nuts. Come on! get Walk up to the pile and then access the pile. Jeez. Dig through the shoe pile. Oh man, all that for nothing. Okay, fine. Dig through the trash pile. <laughs> Propeller blade laying in the middle of the floor. Uh, let's see. Hard to say. Dig through the trash. Ooh, inspect the earring. It's an earring. Great. Inspect the dented lunchbox. It's a dented lunchbox. Inspect the cred stick. <laughs> By inspect, I mean slot. Well, let me just have a look at this cred stick here. Oh no, I accidentally just forcibly stole 200 new yen from, an, from a uh, dead guy. Anyway, so basically you send a little drone through this uh, through this what an air conditioning spirit? You can feel a wild spirit within this object. Within the air conditioning uh, you will be able to control it for a moment but it's enough time to open the locked door from the other side. Do it! Ah! 
Wow. Well, apparently you don't just have to be a rigger. You don't just have to send a guy through that little tube. You can use summoning or whatever to get the key. Oh, a magnetic screwdriver. Why does it have to be a magnetic screwdriver? Couldn't it have just been any screwdriver? You're telling me in this entire place the object that I needed to use to get into uh, that little secret room is a magnetic screwdriver. And it's the only screwdriver in this entire warehouse. Nobody has anything on their keychain. Nothing. Wow. The lock panel easily comes... Oh, I don't know what it said. Open or something. Yes, and I can't remember what's in here. An old diary. An old diary. Mission objective. It appears to be the diary of a teenage girl. Great. Doesn't help me any. Oh, unless it helps me with the seance or whatever. Anyway. I got the items you need. Let's get started. Oh, we can't get started. Enter McCluskey. Who the hell are you guys? Well, apparently Officer Aguirre allows the sister of the victim and some random elf off the street to uh, investigate murders. So, mm. yeah, there's that. McCluskey, not so open-minded. He's like, get the boop out of my crime scene. Don't worry, we'll come back when they're gone. We'll sneak in and we'll do the whole thing ourselves. Even though it might not lead anywhere, we'll try it anyway. Uh, yeah, I know who they are. Here's four grand to hire shadow runners. Thanks. Uh, let's see. Hey, Coyote says, what are you doing? I say, I'm here. And she's like... Oh, that's cool. Hey, come help me kill people. Yeah, all right. I found my my cousin Gino. Great. I'll help you out. Thanks. That's some, that's some heavy dialogue there. Coyote's Crusade. The cluster of dilapidated buildings where Coyote told you to meet her appears to be the remnants of a public housing project. Great. Auto saved. Awesome. Air conditioning spirit. Uh, yeah, no problem. Let's do this. All right. Let's have fun. Good. Thanks. Great. Okay. That's enough talking. Thank you. Let's go. Or let's get in. I'm like, what are you doing, orc? She leans in and whispers in your ear. That's funny. She's like, Lee. I'm literally face to face with the guy. She's like, he's a clocker. <laughs> I'm like, oh, thanks for telling him what he is. Uh, you sell BTLs, right? I don't sell them. What kind of rides can you go on? Anything you want. They even have crazy ones where you kill people and stuff. How does this place operate? How do you get in? Well, you go in. Oh, that's cool. Don't you think you're hurting people? Uh, guess I'm just looking to hurt. Uh, I'm stepping, stepping back. I want to go in and see for myself. Yeah, I want to go in and see for myself. All right. Probably don't need to... As an elf with one strength, probably don't need to run around punching orcs in the face. The sinless are free. I suppose that's true. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, yeah, this place is crazy. Don't go in there. Do you have a pass card? No, but my son had a pass card before he died. Oh, where's his pass card now? Uh, Jamal's got it or something. Is that the guy's name? Uh, yeah. He sells passes to get in. Are there chip heads? There are chip heads, and they're crazy. They can be dangerous. You know Gino? I know Gino. He's here all the time. Great. Well, then, hopefully he's here now. There are so many air conditionings in the Shadowrun universe. It's crazy. Hey, Jamal. Jamal! That's why I remember that guy's name so well. He reminds me of Slumdog Millionaire. I uh, hear you have a pass card. Yeah, right. I want to pay money for that whatever. I'm super charismatic. I don't have to pay for that stuff. There's really nothing in here. God, so many wasted rooms. So many wasted rooms. Uh, Charlie. What's up, Charlie? Ah, smile. I'll pay you when we come out if we like what we see. Ooh, Charlie's like, okay, you can do that for me. Thanks, Charlie. Man, so many orcs in this world. You get tired of seeing orcs all the time. Hey, there's the couch from the splash screen. And oh, you can look at you can look in this hole. Ooh. What do I see? Whatever. 
Just get in here and get it done. The entire floor of this tenement has been given over to the to a chaos of technology and squalor. Oh no, it's the crew that took out Stevie J's place. I told you it was only a matter of time. Well, this is the Yakuza operation, so they can fight the Yakuza. No civilian casualties, got it, even though they're going to be attacking me. Like nobody's business. Dance for me. Whatever. I'm going to end them. I'm going to run over there and end that guy. Air conditioning spirit. Oh, man. Come on. Dead, dead body spirit. Okay, I'm game. Let's do it. This is my first move. My opening gambit is an apocalypse spirit. I'm gonna use him to kill him. Ah, I'm so smart. And you, okay. This time around, I think I'm gonna keep. Coyote and him separate because I'm tired of that whole grenade shenanigans. Who's better at shooting at a distance? Distance medium. I think Paco has a a baseball bat. Yeah, that's really good for distance shooting. Okay, so Paco Hmm Hmm, I say. Let's just run Paco up. And this is the worst cover ever. Run Paco up. You can just run right here. Start picking people off. No. She's going to be taken care of in time. 10 damage. That's pretty good. Holy cow, there's six bad guys. Ow! Son of a... God, I can think of somebody that's getting a freaking bear totem. Actually, probably not a bear totem. Probably just a heal. Yeah. Just a heal. Oh, wait. I've only got one action point. Oh, no. Oh, man. Yeah, I need all the APs. Give me all that penis man on my way to kill this guy do I want to or do I want to take him out right now let's take him out right now just run right by this guy go straight for it oh come on he's not even moving are you serious thank you god unbelievable unfreaking believable I'm gonna Point blank your face. Ooh, chipped man. How do you miss that? Oh, you didn't miss that time, did you? Gosh. Chipped woman, chipped dwarf, and me. Sixty-one percent. Man, no one's got any skills when it comes to uh shooting anybody. Hey! I dig it back. I dig back everything I ever said bad. Oh, nice. Cody's on fire. Oh, he's bugging out. Ow. How dare you. Ow. Eight damage. Oh, look who it is. All right. Well, now we're bear toteming. Dang it. I don't like it. Oh, man. Paco, it's been nice knowing you, partner. But uh, I think this is where you die. Oh, man, are we all within range? That's so good. Yes! All right. Now kill this guy. <laughs> Toughest decker ever. Okay, can an apocalypse spirit turn off a computer? And the answer is yes. An apocalypse spirit can turn off a computer. Let's, uh, what do we got? I need something that does... No... Psh. 
whatever. That's not enough chance. Get him. Yes! Minus 2 AP. I even froze him in his whatever. So good. Um. Um. Run you up. What? Oh, he only had 1 AP? This is stupid. 2 AP. I need good cover. It's the, the key to survival here is good cover. But I don't want to be so close that she just gets wailed on. Ah, forget it. Oh man, he is scared. What are you shooting at that guy for? Shooting all the way across the map. Well, whatever, knock yourself out. Big wave, dodge plus a million. Wow, this person can actually get out of here now? Can't cast haste on myself, though. Whatever, you need to get somewhere where you're under cover. But you can cast Bear Totem next round and prevent everybody from dying. What is this? Yeah! Oh, awesome, awesome, awesome. Eat him! Aum! I said eat him! Aum! Do it again! Don't you dare miss. Oh, how are you not dead? Whatever. Um... Line of sight? Are you serious? It's so stupid. Come on, man. Ah, everybody's out now. What do you got? What do you got? Dang it. I can't get a spread from that guy. I can't get a spread from that guy either. I'm too close. Ow! You're lucky I'm just a spirit. How are you still awake? Alright. Well, you've got to cast this, because... Everybody around us needs some healing. Oh, awesome. Freaking out, man! Now you're dead. up here and then cast something glue no disease glue stops him from moving what do I need to stop one guy from moving no don't banish the spirit hmm You know what? Let's just go in for the kill. Shaman versus spirit. Ow! Oh, man. Come on. How is that possible? How do you not have a shot? That doesn't make sense. You know what? I'll give you a shot. Just... We'll just step out and end this right now. Wait, what's the... Two attacks, less chance, may hit adjacent target. Now, can you be at point-blank range and have it maybe hit an adjacent target? Well, not the way I chose to do it. Um, come on, kill him. Yes! Is that banished the spirit? How come the spirit's still alive? Okay. So now there's just the one guy, huh? Uh... No. Let's send this guy in. Where did he go? There he is. Hiding in the back corner. Nice! That's the last of them! Gino! I mean, Gino? Gino! Gino! Karma gain one! Optional, do not let any chip heads die. I did that. Alright, 
So we got to be careful this time around. Actually, first let's let's search the area. I don't think I did this last time either. Uh oh, I've alerted somebody. Why is everybody running? Have I broken it? Uh, nothing in there. Why is everybody running around? Oh my god, I gotta wait for everybody to finish running around just to search this room? Are you serious? Okay, well I take it back. I don't want to search the room. I can't. There's nothing in here. I'm just wasting everybody's time. Whatever. Alright, Gino. Let's talk. Oh, yeah, you're looking good. So, uh, what the hell? You slotted me out? She's horrified. Gino, it's me, Carla. I don't care. Slot me back in. Slot me back in. Gino, no. Coyote, be careful. Gino grabs a gun. Take it easy, Gino. We're backing off. Uh, you gotta get off these chips now. Drop the gun, Gino. Take it easy, Gino. We're backing off. You gotta be, like, super nice to him, apparently. Uh, what the hell's wrong with you people? We're trying to help you. Put the gun down, Gino. Come with us. Uh, okay. No, you don't understand. He points again at Coyote. You're not gonna freaking help me. Gino, no. Ow. Well... Apparently I got shot that time. I'm so sorry. Alright, well apparently I didn't save Gino's life. He was totally zoned. You had no choice. Even when I'm trying to save his life, I can't save his life. I'm baffled. <laughs> Shannon's plan is the best lead you've got to find out more about the Ripper. In case the frames drop. God, this is a long loading screen. Come on. Come on. Last little click. Thank you. All right. Uh, talk to the fixer, Mr. Delilah, about uh, hiring runners. Great. Sounds like fun. Um, that was actually a pretty entertaining battle for me anyway. I don't know how long the episode was. 11 Karma. What can we spend karma on? I don't know why I'm spending karma, because I'm not going to... Well, I'm probably going to save and think. What's next on the list? Can summon two spirits from the same point. I need that so bad. I need that right now. That's so good. Um, Yeah, okay. Uh, Increase spell slot. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, well, we can't afford that anyway. Uh, Okay, so that was episode six. Thanks for watching. Uh, and when we come back, we're going to hit the NTSB warehouse one more time.